Hello everybody and welcome to Infinity Trip. You, you're basically taking a trip through Infinity with this game. That's actually a really accurate title now that I think about it. But anyway, let's actually, um, let's just see what this game's about. Well, let me, let me show you what the game's about because I pretty much already know. Um, it's actually a really cool game. Reminds me of a, uh, I don't know what the game's called. It's like a... It was like a 8 or 16 bit, I think it was 16 bit, but it was like a helicopter game. And it was basically exactly the same. Oh, the wrong way. I thought I could go out for some reason, wasn't paying attention. But, um, yeah, like I was saying, it was like 16 bit, and it was kind of the same, although it didn't look nearly as cool as this. And it was like, um, it had the same controls where you just hold, um, held left click and it would go up and down, but. Um, besides all that, there was like, you know, obviously it was like 16-bit or whatever, I really don't know. So, it didn't look the best, although it was pretty much the exact same thing. It looked really, it looked cool when I played it, it wasn't that bad, and I had a lot of fun with it. I genuinely love these kinds of games, because, you know, they're so relaxing, and then when you get smacked by the, by an obstacle, it's like, why, why have I done this? It's also really cool in the fact that I didn't even notice, but the the background is actually, well, the, the um, obstacles, I guess, are actually changing color, which is cool. Now, this game is also kind of like Flappy Bird, although um, in this game, you actually have to fly through the rings to actually get your score up. The, the green things, or whatever color you want to call them, they're kind of like teal, I guess, but... Those give you points that you can actually use to buy, I guess, other ships. I, I don't know if they have any other value other than like being a cosmetic type of thing. Not exactly sure. But I have 49 of them. I think I got like 39 from the reward thing that you can see here. But <clears throat> anyway, it's like, you know, um, in conjunction with the music, it's like one of those really... You know, it's, it's really nice just because I like these kinds of games and it has the music so it's even more relaxing than, you know, it already is. And commentating with this is not the best. Look, I got the achievement. Bullseye, whatever that says. I can't even see it. My screen's too big. I can't see anything because stuff. Man, it's like... Sometimes it scares me when I, when I actually hit something because it's like so loud. Like, the game's quiet, and then all of a sudden when you hit something, it just, like, smacks your ears in the face. Yeah, smacks your ears in the face. <laughs> what kind of, what kind of witchcraft is that? But anyway, it, like, smacks your ears with this, like, sound. And it, it just scares me sometimes because I'm not, like, paying attention. But, like I said, it's a really cool game. And I could see myself like playing these, like playing this on my in my own time for like a little bit. I had a lot of fun with the helicopter one. I think I got to like, um, probably like 200 on that one. I don't know. This one, oops, <laughs> this one is a little bit more tricky, mainly because uh, it actually has like these obstacles. The I don't think the helicopter one actually had obstacles. I don't know the name of it, like I said, but. Uh, I don't think that one had obstacles, I think that one is more like, oh, don't touch the, you know, like, don't touch the edge. Which, I guess you could say the edge is an obstacle, but when I mean obstacle, I mean, like, um, platforms that are kind of, like, floating out there, I guess. Oh, <laughs> I, I was holding it, but for some reason it, it didn't actually register, I guess. Um, that was actually an issue on the other one, too, I remember, the helicopter one, where... Even when you would like hold uh, or let go of the mouse, it would like still uh, keep on going up. I don't know if that's just my mouse or if that's like just a thing with these games. But anyway, I know I'm like doing really bad. But when you're right, keep on clicking this by accident. But when you're playing these kinds of games, it's like I don't know. Especially when you're commentating, I know I keep on using that excuse way too much because I'm commentating. But oops. Actually, um, let's go into this just to show you. We got the the spaceship garage, and I think we have to use W or D. And these are all the things. As you can see, they cost a lot, and I only have 62, so this might actually take a long time to actually get if you wanted to get all of these, but I guess this is like the main point of the game. 
like just to get all these. I don't think they do anything. Like I said, I think they're just mainly for looks. <clears throat> and I, I think that's it. I don't think they do anything else besides, you know, being for looks. Now, um, from what I remember, this game does not use the, like you can't use space, which I would actually prefer because I, I'm more used to using the space bar because I believe the other one did use the space bar. But, um, this game also reminds me of, uh, um, what's it called? Uh, <laughs> what's it, uh, what's it called? Like, I forgot what it's called. Like, a game on the phone. But anyway, oh, um, <laughs> is it? Uh, why can't I remember? You know, you know that one that, the, the one on the phone that's like, you, you gotta tap and he like jumps. Why can't I not remember that game for the life of me? Is it, um, something road? Like, uh, I had the game like a second ago. I was just thinking of it before I started recording. And like, now I can't, I can't remember the game now. You guys know what I'm talking about. But anyway, that, you know, that game, we'll just call it that game. Really reminds me of it. <laughs> and, oh, <laughs> but you know, it reminds me of it mainly because of like, oh, the reward and... Um, whatever and the the box kind of looks the same like the exact same as that one is it um happy road no <laughs> happy road that sounds stupid but why can't I not remember the name it probably is something like that but oh well I haven't played that game in a um, in a while though I don't know if there's a limit to like how many of those you can miss or you know the rings I mean or if the or if it just you know you don't get any score if you don't hit the rings Oh, why did it, it's, it seemed like it was zooming in for a second. <laughs> that was weird. Um, yeah, so this game's like basically all mouse. Like you don't use anything. Well, the only time you use the keyboard is to like scroll through the uh, spaceship thing. But, you know, like I said, if I didn't suck. <laughs> but it, it's just like a really relaxing game and the music just adds to it. It's like really nice. And... It, it's I'm pretty sure it's a lot more responsive than the helicopter game was because I remember there being like a slight delay I can't believe I got no points on that one, but let's just keep going for a little bit I at least want to see if I can get to like 20 or something I know I can but for some reason especially when I'm commentating like it just it just doesn't work nothing wants to work for some reason but <clears throat> Hopefully hopefully Joe can do the thing Oh, the, it's a multiplier system. Okay, that makes a little bit more sense. Like, I was wondering why, like, my ring count was, like, higher than what I actually went through. Let's see. No. <laughs> well, it, it is, like, a multiplier system. I, I guess if the rings are, like, really close together. Like, let's see. Two. Okay. Well, now I'm not paying attention. But is it just certain rings? Or is it, like... Hmm, that one gave me two. I, I, I'm not, I'm, I don't understand. Like, is it if I fly th um, straight through it? Is that it? Let me see. Yeah, I think if I fly straight through the ring, it's giving me two points instead of one. Or multiple. Hmm, yeah, it might be a multiplier based on, like, if you get it perfectly. That might be it. And as you can see, I'm, for some reason, it seems like I'm perfectly dodging them. I'm not trying to. But, the... The dots are like really like there's a lot of them. I'll just say that. So we got 26. It's good. Let's go um go again, and see. At least this is like randomly. Okay. At least it's like randomly generated. I don't know why I'm like instinctively clicking on the blue box. I don't know why. But anyway, yeah. So it seems if you touch the circle or the ring, whatever, um, it gives you one point. But if you fly through it, it gives you like multiple. <clears throat> so. Maybe the best bet is like keep on clicking. I can do this. Watch this. Listen, listen to my loud mouse. Oh, wait. Is this one of those games where if you click really fast, you go up like super fast? Because I think the other game had that too. Okay, now, <laughs> now I'm like dying at the beginning. To be honest, you could probably do that if you wanted to farm points. Like intentionally, intentionally. Not. I keep on adding an N. Like intentionally. Like. Like an end where it's not supposed to go. I know it has an end and I'm I'm just being stupid, but um <laughs> why is it doing that? But you could um I guess keep on dying so you can get the these things, the the dots. 
but <laughs> because they probably spawn like a lot at the beginning so you could like intentionally die uh, or stuff but anyway <clears throat> it's just me being dumb I don't know why it's almost like I'm doing this on purpose but I'm not <laughs> but let's see let's see get to them let's see if I can beat my score of stupidity that's my I'm gonna die okay no I'm not I thought I was gonna die Oh, I like this background. It's kind of like, I don't know, something about it. It's like, it's not distracting nearly when it's gray like this. But it's like, I'm trying to, yeah, I'm dead. But I'm trying to do that thing where I'm like, I'm trying to look ahead, but I'm also trying to look at my guy. I probably should just be looking at my guy most of the time and not looking ahead. Because I think I'm paying more attention to looking up ahead than I am actually looking at the guy. But anyway, uh, I'm going to stop the video there. So... Um, yeah, Infinity Trip, I don't think this game is even that much. It might actually be on sale. I, I think it's usually a dollar. It might be like 60 cents. I think it actually is 60 cents USD. But, <clears throat> yeah, 60 cents US dollar because it's not even a dollar. That's really weird. But anyway, I'm going to stop the video right here, guys. So, see you later and goodbye. I'll see you in the next video. Eh.